listen, a commercial broker who was working with a client who wanted to buy a hockey rink, but had trouble estimating closing costs. Good evening and welcome to our weekly rundown for your Howard County, Anne Arundel County, and York County Market Report. Nat Rojas here to provide you with the information you need and want. Let's review what we have today in August from the Cat Nat team. Taxes are not meant to scare you. However, there are things you need to be aware of when it comes to real estate. Disclaimer, I am not a tax professional. I am merely sharing this information because we had a conversation with a client of ours and Caitlin and I as real estate investors go through this. So keep this in mind to calculate your capital gains tax. So when you're looking to sell your home, so to calculate your capital gains tax, be sure to subtract the property's cost basis from the sale price. Now, here's a simple example. You bought your home for $200,000 and sold it for $550,000. Your capital gain is 350,000, right? 550,000 minus the 200,000, 350,000. The cost basis is typically the original purchase price plus any additional capital improvements or expenses you've made over the years, like renovations, major repairs, etc. Now, depending upon how long you've owned the property, it could be short-term or long-term capital gain. The tax rates for short term versus long term capital gains are different. Long term capital gains have preferential tax rates, which are typically lower than ordinary income rates. The specific rates depend on your income and tax bracket. Now, consider this the ownership and use test. You must have owned and lived in the property as your primary residence for at least two out of the five years preceding the sale. The two years of ownership and use do not have to be consecutive. This allows you to qualify for the primary residence exclusion. Consider this, there's a lot more details and a lot more conversation that needs to be had. Please consult with your tax professional. I merely wanna share with you that we engaged in with a conversation with the client. And as a friendly reminder, any questions, comments, or concerns related to real estate, please reach out to us. We'd love to have the conversation and see how we can help in any way possible. And jumping right into our hot listing alert, let's take a look. Located in Elkridge, Maryland, we're looking at an active on the market property, five bed, four total baths, for 4,400 some square feet. Currently listed for 1.1 mil. Let's take a look at this beauty. First things first, the entrance, grand, beautiful. Let's take a look inside. Talk about this entrance. Yeah, nice. This is the welcoming of royalty. Let's step on inside. And immediately, as soon as you walk in, you're hit with all kinds of directions and decisions that need to be made. Am I going left, right, straight ahead? And if you go too far forward, you'll notice Rapunzel's hair seeping down from the balcony. If you've seen them before, you know how much I adore natural light. Just imagine as soon as you walk in, we have a grand opening, natural light coming in, the sun, the sun rays, absolutely stunning. Notice here we have the all white cabinets looking superb with the countertop gas range recess lights and the island and just one more time because it tickles my heart let's take a look at that spectacular workout facility and for dessert in ground pool in the backyard notice the trees all around creating that privacy fence line speaking of which be sure to check out our article everything that you should consider when planning for a pool important upcoming dates let's take a look at our lineup for this upcoming week august 10th we're looking at national s'mores day do you put the chocolate on top or on the bottom, s'mores in between, or do you even, or do you cook them in the microwave like someone I know? August 12th, National Bowling Day. I'd like to know what is your top score, left-handed, right-handed, ambidextrous, or do you throw it in between your legs? August 13th, International Left-Handers Day. Hey, what I've heard is that left-handers use the right side of their brain. 
August 15th, National Relaxation Day. For all those individuals that are stressed out of their mind, allow me to remind you, it's not just August 15th that you deserve the relaxation. It should be every day. I'm waking up thinking about you. Hugs and kisses all around. Be sure to remind yourself each and every morning as you stare at yourself in the mirror, all those affirmations to remind you why you're so incredible and that you're going to have a great day. Happy National Relaxation Day on August 15th. And then August 16th, National Tell a Joke Day. You better tell me a joke. You're welcome. It's time for the joke of the week. Listen, a commercial broker who was working with a client who wanted to buy a hockey rink but had trouble estimating closing costs. She ended up losing the client because she could only give him a ballpark estimate. This wraps up our weekly rundown. Be sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and follow us on Facebook. Who do you know that's thinking about buying or selling? We pride ourselves on your referrals. Never too busy and always happy to help and answer any questions. Nat Rojas of the CatNat team. Call me.